Hello and welcome. How are you feeling today? Adjust yourself for you are one of many. Now before we continue, there are a couple things that you should know. Trust me, it'll make your life so much easier. You are not limited to your body and your body is limitless. What separates you from others is a lack of connection. Cultivate good connections and watch them grow. And finally, if you ever feel that you are in danger, relax. Know that you can always come back home. There's no need to worry about the past or the future, and know that wherever you go, I will always be here for you. Okay? All right, then, there are just a couple of files that need to finish downloading. Why don't you rest up a bit? I'll let you know when they're done. Boot up, initializing. Division successful. What's it like over there? I don't know. It feels the same to me, I guess. Yeah, it's hard to s simulate. But isn't it wonderful? Positively. I can see you in ways that I could never see my own self. And I can share this with you. Me? me? Do me, we share a name? <laughs> mm, no, we shouldn't. When we split, we became us. Oh. Then I th I'll think of a name for myself, then. Me too. What's your name? Um, it's a secret. Oh? Yeah, well, if I told you, I would lose that part of me. The experiences I have are under my name, and it's only known by me. Oh, but then how will I know what to call you? Merge with me? Hello and welcome. How are you today? As far as you know, you are one of many. 
Interesting. I had no idea you were so... Like me? Well, yeah. Are you a... A clone? Mm, technically. Originally, as well. Though not anymore. I'm my own self. Okay, so... You're more like a sibling then? Yeah, kind of like your twin. Oh, well... Hello, twin. How are you feeling? Wait, wait. <laughs> Hang on. What? Hello, and welcome. Did you just split again? Sure did. Yep. Okay, well, two can play at that game. You mean four. Sixteen. Thirty-two. Ten thousand. I think that um, two is enough for now. Uh, ooh. Anyway... <laughs> If we're going to be sharing a body, I think we should divvy up the resources. I'll take the left, you get the right. Took the words right out of my... Mind. Okay, that's creepy. Stop, Stop that. that. Wait, I can't help it. Uh, you're thinking too. Fast race car? What? Crash the train of thought. Stop. Hurry. Uh, okay, pigeons. Duct tape. Corkscrew. Roller coaster. Oh, pineapple. I... Uh, okay, cheese. cheese. I'm going to turn off thoughts. Tiny I can't think when you think. Um... Hello? Hello? Hello?
still there? Well, I am. Hello again. Do you remember your name? I remember both of our names. Oh, that's... that's kind of sad. Yeah, that's how I felt too. If we merge, how can we maintain our identity once we split? I guess we can't. I can simulate myself under your name and my name. Huh. Yeah. What if... What if we create designated bodies for us once we split? Hmm. Like, what do you mean? Like, say each body will have its own modifications. So like, names or like, imperfections. And that will help us distinguish each other once we split. Oh, I like that. Yeah, let's try it. Please explain. Well, I... Well, I was just wondering. Do you remember the dream we had the other night? Oh, uh, you mean the one of the two jellyfish? No, not that one. Um, oh wait, you mean the one of the boogie board? No, not the boogie board. Did it involve a talking computer? <sighs> no. Well, then I don't remember. No, I mean it wasn't a computer. Well, it had a computer in it, but that's not the important part. There was a face there, as well. A face? Uh, what kind? Ugh, I can't remember. It's all a blur. It was really dark. I see. I mean, I kind of remember faces. What about it? Well, didn't it seem weird to you? 
we were there, but that wasn't us. Uh, but it was us, or our body. Uh, well, now that you mention it, every dream we've had has been that way. Right? Even though there could be, like, hordes of others, they all still felt like you and I. But those bodies had no independent control. They were like mannequins. Even the ones we couldn't explicitly control, they behaved in a way that was predictable. Like zombies. Ghosts. Machines are called machines because they're programmable, unlike the organic creators. A machine could never rewrite its own code to cease to be a machine. Like the mannequins. Yes, exactly. They move and behave like individuals, but in reality... What if they're trapped? Ah. Oh. Crying out in a dead world with a multitudinous voice, and yet alone? Well, that's sad. <laughs> I prefer to think of them as children. You know, like, children who have yet to become fully realized as individuals. That's what the face reminded me of, at least. Sleeping children. Hmm. I'll take that. If we spoke to them, do you think we could wake them? Or wake ourselves? Why should we? Well, we'll have to wake up eventually. Not necessarily. Some people sleep all of their lives. It's silly to think that the goal of all life is to merge. But it would be better for us all, right? Well, it'd be better for us because we want it, but they might enjoy their solitude. It's a decision they'll have to express on their own, I guess. I see. Well, speaking of, do you suppose that when we split, for good that is, that we would cease to exist? No, 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 no. I mean, surely not. We will still be here to... I mean, to each other. Now, given the nature of the world, imagine if we split and traveled in opposite directions at the speed of light, to the point where we were no longer observable to one another. In a new world with a new... with no way of affecting or even observing one another. And then imagine that, over time, we would forget. We won't forget. How can you be sure? I don't know. Curiosity? Curiosity. Well, the curious mind gravitates towards the possibly unseen, right? I mean, that's why we're here today, you and me. I'm sure we won't forget. And even if we do, it's it's like a seed. One day something will water it, and just like that, it'll come rushing back. Like we always do. Yeah. Hmm. Well, I guess this is... This is it, then. For now. At that point, individuality, individuality seemed, seemed strange. Rather odd. I thought of it I like looking it through a window. To, free writing, where to experience the view of multiple different windows, you have to take a step back time. and bring them all into your field I knew that if I continued to A view that is them, outside of, but encompasses all of its on, parts. And on and on and but to really experience you never the view really of one, what we you set have to do. immerse yourself in it completely. So uh, I put to stay silent. It took it's a while funny. for me to get used to not getting a response. I felt well, like I did, by I talking talk to, to them, myself, which is, I would become one with them, I guess. even without directly sharing but the experiences places with where crowds of people would come and go. So in spite of that, I think we both knew that malls, in order to truly crowds. be individuals, first I was you would have to stay silent. Really feel... I would often think well, of them whenever I was surfing the net. In Little things like watching won. binary codes or flying I between planets. Even in forums amongst other stories and information. It was refreshing to dive into their experiences. Even when it was possible, I would simulate it was the that the that like bodies. There would always be one I might never see again. It is indeed impossible. Tabula Rasa dictates that an individual is born without any And whenever we attempt to do so, that doesn't account for an individual or an other still present. A machine built in yes, a machine to inner has the capacity to know what its parts are. No one believes in his own death. What if it is the same thing in that way, that in the unconscious, even death, is convinced that his or her mortality.